Manitoba has far too many career politicians. I won't be one of them. It's been just under 10 months since Mayor Brian Bowman decided not to seek re-election for mayor in 2022, and the list of candidates to replace him is taking shape. Councillor Marcus Chambers is among those thinking about running for Winnipeg's 44th mayor. It's uh, a situation where I haven't ruled it out. I'm still laser focused on the work that I need to do for the residents of St. Norbert, St. River, who elected me as their city councillor. And then the leadership role that I've been given in chair of the Winnipeg Police Board. Thinking about running and then actually running for mayor are both completely different. And Chambers knows there's a lot of work ahead, but says it would be a great honor honor if he did become mayor of Winnipeg. The skills that I bring to the to City Hall again is my ability to work collaboratively, uh, to listen to people, listen to my constituents, listen to those who have voted and uh, put me in this position and uh, I, I think those are the strengths that I, I, I bring and of course building a team uh, around me that could help support me in this role I think would be a, another important piece. Hey, everybody. Shifting to provincial politics, this past week, Premier Brian Pallister announced he will not be seeking re-election as leader of the PC party in Manitoba. Many ministers' names have been mentioned as possibly taking over the leadership role, including Finance Minister Scott Fielding and Families Minister Rochelle Squires. But on Thursday, two PC ministers who have both announced they are not running for Premier plan to back one of their colleagues. I'm strongly encouraging Heather Stephenson to run. She has Many people are encouraging to run, her to run, and uh, I think she would make a, a great premier. I feel that I have a lot of work to do in terms of recovery of this province, but I too, uh, if she does choose to run for leadership, will be endorsing Heather Stephenson. St. James Councillor Scott Gillingham has confirmed to City News that he is seriously considering running for leadership of the PC Party of Manitoba. My team and I are taking calls from and making calls to people across the province. I will have more to say when the party announces the leadership race and outlines the details of the process. The Progressive Conservatives were re-elected under Pallister in the fall of 2019 after he led the party to a majority in the 2016 provincial election. But the party has been trailing Wab Canoe and the NDP party in recent polling. In Winnipeg, Alex Carpacity News.